crazy contrarian, even more contrarian than me. And if that's your thing, you know, God bless you. As far as the Braves go, I respect Hernandez, but I mean, he's not as good as this Braves offense. That's for sure. Um, the Braves are just really good. Bad spot for Hernandez, you know, big ballpark downgrade for him. Their whole lineup's in play. Top pieces, Freeman always. Uh, you know, their outfield's really good, depending, not even depending. Their outfield's really good. We'll have to just wait and see who's in, who's out there tonight. Swanson's price is down a little bit. Albies is under 5K. So, yeah, they make sense as a stack for sure. Uh, all right, Yankees and Mets. So the, the Mets had a nice game last night. Uh, no one was, like, crazy good, but talked about Javier Baez. Um you know, he's red hot right now. Uh, 50 D, six, 50, sorry, excuse me, my bad. 50 DK points over the last two games. It's Saturday, so forgive me over here. 50 DK points over the last two games. Big power speed upside. Um, I'm not really looking to stack the Mets, but Kluber, I mean, I don't, I don't really know what to make of Kluber at this point. I, I'm not using him. I'm not really trying to stack against him, although he gives up homers. He walks guys like... Oh, this might be a doubleheader, though. Let me see one thing. That, okay. Hold on. No. Oh, Toronto, Baltimore. In the early state, excuse me. Um, I don't know. I think both offenses in this game are like kind of intriguing again. Uh, they don't jump off the page, but both these pitchers are more named than anything, in my opinion, at this point. And the offenses, when clicking on all cylinders, are pretty good. Uh, the Mets are really cheap. Conforto, nice, nice game last night. Like, these guys are okay right now. McNeil was pretty good last night. They didn't even homer, I don't think, and they put up 10 runs. Alonzo didn't do anything. Actually, yeah, Lindor homered. Finally, Lindor did something. Um, yeah, so. Uh, yeah, I mean, the Mets stack, I think, is going to be super, super low owned, and I don't hate it at all. Um, and then the Yankees, kind of the same boat. Um, I think the Mets are, like, in much better form than the Yankees right now, which is weird, but true. Uh Rizzo's homer in back-to-back games. So we know the Yankees are just awesome. Judge, Stanton, Gallo, all these guys. Gardner pres- presumably leading off. Um, so, yeah, don't hate it at all. A couple more Padres and Dodgers. So, Walker Bueller against Chris Paddock. I'm not interested in picking on Walker Bueller here. Uh, and the Dodgers. Yeah, I think the Dodgers are in play. They're picking up a little bit of ownership. Uh, Muncie had a nice game last night. He looks like he's getting going again. Mookie Betts is always in play. Um, you know, the Turner brothers, their lineup's just amazing. So if you do your thing, I don't think that that's where I'm going to land, though. I kind of expect this game to be, this whole series to be more low scoring. That said, if I were to pick a side, it's easily the Dodgers. All right, last but not least, Mariners and Diamondbacks. So this is an interesting one. We've got Castellanos against Flexen. I think both offenses are in play. Seattle offense stands out a little bit more. Um, you know, they were pretty good yesterday against Bumgarner. Won that game five to four. JP Crawford looks good right now leading off. Mitch Haniger hitting second. Seager's expensive. But, yeah, Seattle is a stack that I don't think gets a lot of love that I could definitely see using here. And I also like Arizona. Um, you know, Flexen hasn't been great recently. You know, doesn't strike a lot of guys out. Like, I think Arizona's in a sneaky good spot. They add the DH here. A guy that was raking in the minors that I've used a bunch since he got called up. Um, not Seth Beer, who also homered last night. Where's my boy Ramos? Ramos homered yesterday. Um yeah, like we'll have to wait and see what their lineup is, but I don't hate the idea of like a game stack in this game, especially with how the slate plays out. Like there are there aren't any like spots where I'm like crazy scared of fading. No like cores, no Toronto at Baltimore against their crappy bullpen. Yeah, I think Houston has a good night, and I like Houston, but you can use some Houston. And then sure, there's 
obviously talked about the Yankees and Mets, the Braves, the Reds, you know, the, the, the Twins and Royals could obviously have good games, uh, but you can't play everyone anyway. So interested in that Seattle-Arizona game that's kind of a tournament game stack. All right, guys, that's what I got for you. I hope you enjoyed it. Hopefully you guys have a really good rest of your Saturday and uh, are excited for NFL tomorrow because I know I am for sure. All right, guys, thanks again. Bye.